I'm Vanessa Ferreira. I'm a president and founder for the Portuguese Association for CBG and other metabolic rare disorders. I'm member for the Spanish Association for the Same Disease, and I'm collaborator in the EpiRare uh, project, the European platform for uh, registries in rare diseases. Um, I would like to share with uh, the CDG online community that uh, the last weekend we had the first uh, Luso Hispanic uh, CDG meeting, which was a huge success because um, we had uh, the interaction between patient medical doctors and uh, researchers, and um, we could give, we could manage to give visibility to CDG because we had 25 families coming from different parts from Spain and we had also two families coming from France and one family coming from Portugal and uh, our CDG community did interesting uh, um, questions to, to, the, um, to the speakers and uh, we could all interact together in order to learn to get more information about CDG concerning diagnosis, concerning treatments and future, future plans that our researchers and medical doctors have. During the meeting, um, a part of all talks uh, in terms of scientific uh, knowledge and medical uh, knowledge, we had a video from a family from Australia that told us about how he's living with CDG in Australia because they are quite isolated and in fact one of our main goals as association is to put all CDG patient voice together, collaborating together, combining efforts in order to spread the word congenital disorders of glycosylation worldwide. So in fact this family um, presented a, a tool of um, communication that um, the, their daughter used to, 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 be real, to be able to communicate, which is a light writer. And many families from our Spanish community and Portuguese community became very interested in this uh, device. Furthermore, we had also the presentation of uh, the metabolic, uh, Guia Metabolica that will pre be presented later by Mercedes Serrano. And uh, we had also the chance to present uh, the CDG awareness and dissemination kit tool that uh, we coordinated with different collaborators, Andrea Berarducci from USA and Bas Houten from Netherlands. And this CDG awareness uh, and dissemination kit, it will be used by families to talk about CDG in schools, in faculties, uh, in, in the city halls, in all places that they, uh, that they can in, d in different places in order to, um, to talk about what is a rare disease and how is living with CDG. In fact, each family can produce their own PowerPoint because it is a kind of template. A part of this uh, kit tool, we also presented the CDG online community and we also um, presented a fairy tale that is uh, dedicated to Professor Jack Chacken that uh, described the CDG 30 years ago. And uh, this fairy tale, it, it will be a useful tool for awareness and dissemination because it, it explains in an easy way what, what is CDG. And uh, it also explains that we have all to put efforts together in order to um, support families because uh, families, the majority of them, they are isolated, they are spread in different points and uh, they need all our support in order to inform them and if they are informed they can take decisions related with their diagnosis because they are understanding their diagnosis So, and that, that, that is for us extremely important. From all the group of uh, researchers and medical doctors that participated, I have to say that we are extremely grateful because they were all and they are all committed with our uh, organizations. And uh, when I invited them to participate to our meeting, they all said yes immediately. And we had the chance to have Dr. Uh, Carla Astigiano from Argentina. She came. To, to attend to our meeting to give a talk, 
We had as well um, a researcher from Portugal, Dr. Dos Kellas, and then we had uh, different researchers from Spain. And this was a good combination because uh, they all, uh, we, we managed to potentiate collaborations between these different groups. And furthermore, we had uh, a group from Lisbon, from Dr. Paula Videira, and uh, a group from the south of Spain that came to our meeting because they wanted to talk with our researchers and medical doctors in order to collaborate and improve CDG research. For us, this was one of our main achievements, and uh, we are happy that uh, our associ associations, they are able to join uh, these main stakeholders.